car parked for long in Rotterdam if you happen to be the proud owner of an auto that's seen better days. The authorities don't want old crocs cluttering up their streets. In fact, they've got a collection service for old bangers that takes them for a ride, a last one. Journey's end. A scrapyard where the proud model of yesteryear is given a helping hand on the last road to a pressing engagement. In a few moments, the car that was once somebody's pride and joy won't be recognizable. The car crushing plant can handle up to 100 vehicles a day. Reading the streets of Olrex helps keep the traffic moving freely. Rotterdam drivers say it's a great idea, but they think twice before leaving their cars parked for any length of time. Maybe they've found the answer to the growing problem of the abandoned old car. Any local authority collecting 500 or more can apply to a Stratford-on-Avon firm to come along with the Scrapmaster, the world's biggest mobile bailing press. This demonstration is at Bridge End, South Wales. See how it reduces derelict car bodies into hunks of scrap in three minutes flat. One good squeeze deserves another, and what a squeeze. The bailer's intentions, strictly dishonorable. The ram packs a punch of more than 300 tons, forcing the metal to the guillotine, which slices it into nice, even chunks. There's no charge to the local authority. The bailer owners take their pay in the form of the scrap metal. Old car disposal is piling up into a major problem. Unless something is done, there'll be a million lying about in five years' time. To that pessimistic prediction, the mobile bailer makes a crushing retort. <laughs> 